So one of the things uh, that's interesting about carbon dioxide, one of the many things, in fact, is that it is an acidic gas. So that means when it dissolves into water, it will form um, an acidic solution. Uh, and so <clears throat> this is part of the reason, for example, that uh, soda pop, which has dissolved carbon dioxide in it, right, to give the bubbles, um, is uh, relatively acidic. So what I've got here in front of you is a uh, cylinder with some tap water in it. Uh, and I've added something called universal indicator to us. So it's gonna tell us about the relative acidity of the water. Um, right now it's green because green and universal indicator means it's about neutral pH. It's not really acidic, it's not really basic. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna add a little bit of sodium hydroxide to this so that we can make it basic. So sodium hydroxide is a base. And when I do this, you will see it turn blue. In fact, it's gonna turn a very dark blue because sodium hydroxide is a very strong base. So yep, you can see it's gone from blue all the way to purple. <coughs> so this is a very acidic, or sorry, a very basic solution right now. And what we're going to do is we're going to take some dry ice and we're going to add it to that tube. So I've got some small pieces of dry ice here and we're going to drop them in, we're trying to find a little bit smaller piece here. Okay, so we're gonna drop them in and we're going to watch the color change as a result, okay? Okay, you can see it's gone from purple to blue to green. So it's about neutral right now. It's starting to turn a little bit yellow. Now it's very yellow. And as more acid continues to dissolve in it, it's going to approach a red color. Now we can see that the solution has turned um